ever post that deep emotional rant at 2 a.m. and wake up thinking, did I just overshare my whole story with strangers? Welcome to the online dishibitation effect. This happens because online, unlike IRL, you are invisible. No eye contact, no judgment. Just a comfy digital mask. But that anonymity gives your brain VIP access to the tell all my secrets button. Psychologist John Suller breaks it down to six sneaky factors. Anonymity, invisibility, delayed timing, feeling like it's all in your head, treating it like a game, and ignoring authority. It's basically the perfect recipe for oversharing chaos. And get this, Adam Johnson found that students emailed stranger four times more personal info than they did face to face. But throw in webcam and uh, self-disclosure drops instantly. No camera, no filter. So why does this matter? For teens and honestly for all of us, oversharing can be tied to anxiety, attention seeking and even sad fishing. I'm so depressed, but just really fishing for likes. This is not catharsis, it's a red flag. Here's your hack. Pause before posting. Ask yourself, would I say this face to face to my best friend? Just reduce some digital boundaries. Private journaling instead of public friends. Or even wait a few hours before posting. Trust me, future self will thank you. All right, spill. What's the funniest thing you've ever overshared? Drop in the comments. Or maybe keep it between us in real life, you know, stay witty, stay wise.